Well, we hope you had a chance to enjoy our auction preview show, which began airing last week. The show can also be viewed online. It'll continue to air at specially selected times this week as we gear up for our biggest one day fundraiser of the year, the TV 44 auction. Of course, that is coming up September the 10th. Auction items are still being accepted, and now is an excellent time for you to bring in your donations, large or small, trailer loader. Just a shopping bag full. We are blessed by the items you are willing to donate to the TV 44 auction. Speaking of donations, we're going to tell you a little more about some of the items that have just arrived in the past few days. That's right. Much thanks to Chris Conley, whom we introduced you to earlier this year in connection with the Kirkmont Center and Camping Facility. He worked to get all of these donations available. A week's stay at the Habitat House at the Kirkmont Center. The center sits on 274 acres and has seven miles of trails to explore. But that's not all. Logan County, other things on our auction getaway trips. Chris has also arranged for four tickets to the Ohio Caverns, a Logan County throw and other items from the Logan County Historical Center, a $50 gift certificate to the Bed and Breakfast Escape Route 508, two tickets to see Fetterspiel at the Holland Theater on September 23rd. They're a seven piece brass band from Vienna plus a gift basket for Marie's Candies. Thank you so much to Chris Conley and all the Logan County businesses for donating such incredible items to the TV44 auction. Also in Logan County, Shine FM is donating two tickets to the upcoming Sidewalk Profits concert. And some more information on the Landmark Events Tour that will be available during the auction getaway trips. This is called Civil War in the West. It's a multi-day, multi-site tour. Landmark Events creates historical tours that are presented from a biblical standpoint. They promote their events as family-friendly events where you learn, visit historical sites, but can do so in the presence of like-minded individuals. We're gonna have a trip to Tennessee for their Civil War in the West tour. Working to their website, the Civil War in the West tour joins military historian Bill Potter on a fascinating tour of the Civil War in Middle Tennessee. It includes visits to remarkable sites and tells the compelling and tragic stories of the brave, sacrificial men and the resilient, compassionate women swept up in the storm of war. Day one includes tours of three historic homes in Franklin and Spring Hill. Day two follows the Army's path into Nashville and explores Fort Negley. Negley, is that right? Negley, mm -hmm. Negley. He's my historian <laughs> expert over here. You'll also visit monuments outside the Capitol building and can explore the State Museum on your own. The trip will include overnight accommodations and money for gas or food. Just an excellent package for anyone who enjoys history. That is courtesy partly in landmarkevents.org. Also, we are receiving quite a few great donations from our programmers, including looks like some DVDs. That's right. These came from um, these came from Wretched. The Wretched uh, people have sent us an entire box full of items. Um, Andrew Womack's ministry has already sent us a bunch of items as well, and we've heard from a lot of our other programmers who are just overjoyed to be supporting TV44 with our auction endeavor. So, if you have any program on our station that you enjoy. Come out to TV44. It could be a great opportunity to get just a great package. These are all DVDs, lots of books, um, very nice resources here. Now be sure to visit WTLW.com regularly to view our updated pictures of donated items. Also donations are now accepted five days a week, Monday through Friday, 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. Call ahead for any other drop-off days and times. It, it also might help to call ahead if you're going to need people available to help unload. Maybe you've got some large items or some heavy items. So just give us a call at 419-339-4444. And of course, we certainly hope that you will attend this year's auction. It's September 10th.